Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Scramble from Emotionless Crypto Trading and today we're going to advance with the video presentations on Bitcoin, technical analysis, price predictions and the questions related to today's movement which has been pretty nice trying to find market movements above $7,000 BTC shows signs of recovery. We're going to find out what is the data hiding behind the movements and what are the future probabilities within the market as well as set up a daily technical analysis videos on the BTC on this specific channel. So here we go guys, BTC is having a $33 billion volume out of the 164 total for the last 24 hours on the market. 164 which isn't big at all. Compared to the recent averages, it is slightly below the average of the time, which is about $140 billion for the past three weeks. Market gap finally broke out of the $200 billion resistance line for the time. And what I would like to see in the next 12 to 24 hours is a substantial market movement between 200 and 210 billion that would result in consolidation let's get into the data and details of the market and we're going to start with the 15 minute candlestick representation we've got two important lines here that are each trending lines and the rsi indicator which is represented as rsx that is a lot better than the rsi because it avoids the background noises or the empty movements that the rsi does share now talking about the trending lines and the green data over here we've got the uptrending support line this is the one that is activating right now and it's keeping us alive well on the top we have a slight uptrend resistance line this is extremely little oriented upwards it has a powerful top that has been established on 17 of april just a couple of hours ago which is basically the top of the movement that represented the increase on the last 24 to 36 hours now what we have and what happened afterwards on this short-term statistics representing 15 minute is basically a lot of the tops that have been suppressed which is something i don't like to see because i know after such a thing the energy against the bulls and against the supports are increasing which means it goes under danger it is tested and it's going to have difficult time surviving. If it's not going to survive right here, then obviously a breakdown is happening with a target located on the 6,500 areas, somewhere like that. That is something to keep in mind, having the fact that this support line that we're trying to stay above right now, and it's on green color, has been activating since 13 of april with a massive rejection where it has all started and a false breakdown which pretty much confirmed at the time we jumped back into the market with the green swing high candlestick lines towards the two hour candlestick representation we got a long-term channel discussion over here which isn't quite amazing by the way it looks like at the moment the market is finding stability at slight differences from where the support line is located a support line which is active and it has been established on 13 of may the time the cryptocurrency market has suffered a lot from the coronavirus lockdowns and announcements that were made all around the world including the stock market movements that have affected dramatically the crypto market and those were the results 13 of march heavy sell-off btc from 8,000 goes down to 4,500. things were quite dirty 
in some cases even down to four thousand dollars so from there we were able to establish an uptrending channel which looks natural because it does not have parabolic aggressive artificial movement inside it has a very clear top resistance line and a very supportive bottom line as well multiple confirmations are appearing along the way with false breakouts that have signaled us that have signaled that we're not ready to break out and go parabolically back into the high numbers which has happened over there and plus on the bottom side nice supports appearing especially the one on 15 april with a rejection right there you can see the shadow which is below the line that tells us once again that the market tried to break down and it didn't succeed so the bears have been stopped and the market moved up parabolically from there increasing if i'm not wrong the increase is about seven percent which is true by the way so this is where we are i mean if you want to go long and aggressively back into a uptrending channel which is looking promising for the bulls on longer term you need to break out of the resistance which at the moment is located somewhere around eight thousand two hundred dollars that is the target but until that there is a lot of the resistance points that we have to go through and struggle so a movement that could give us a percentage that is considered higher than 40 percent what is the current market probability we're going to touch 8200 in the next about 72 hours is just 40 percent again 60 percent that's still against us just like you know i'm not suggesting you guys to trade anything that is below 80 percent probability rate of success due to the fact that you're going to end up in a huge minus somewhere in the long term and things are going to be pretty difficult so the support line is obviously closer compared to the resistance line which means that the support is in danger at a higher level compared to the resistance the market is not really having movements over there it needs to fight and struggle till it's going to reach those levels so for now we got to make sure that the movement cannot stay below seven thousand dollars it needs to sustain higher levels around seven thousand five hundred and seven hundred over the next 48 hours if we want to establish an uptrending channel that is more aggressive compared to the current one and force the breakout of the resistance line so those are the conditions guys towards the one day candlestick representation well here we've got the market confirming very nicely on the Fibonacci retracement charting 0.236 Fibonacci have given us support but the 0.382 shared with us clear resistances now I'm wondering if in the next two days for the one day candlestick representation is going to be the time we're going to break out of the 0.382 which is the green retracement line that is pretty strong compared to the past reactions I'm wondering if we have that capacity due to the fact that the next start is going to be 8,400 for the Fibonacci retracement, which would be fine because then we would have a clear open range up to the 10,000 area. But once again, all these things could happen only if the market of the stocks, of the indices, of the equities, futures, and all the traditional trading markets are also finding stability which means that coronavirus needs to be stopped down we need a medicine to work it out once that thing is going to appear in the market and would help people to keep coronavirus on the control the markets are going to skyrocket crypto market is going to find minimum 20 percent at the time we have approved testings of a variety of medicines that are clearly helping us to go through the process or stop coronavirus spreading all around the world so once that thing is happening guys 
the market is going to blow out. In the meantime, insecurity is the one that dominates the space. We need to be careful. We need to make sure that all our actions are backed up by data and everything we do is just because that's what the market told us to do, not because that's what we personally want from the market to do in order to reach our goals and complete our desires. Attention, that's not how it works. The market does not care about your goals and desires and it's not going to react based on your uh, instinctual needs. Therefore, I'm definitely suggesting you to walk through scramblecoaching.com and look after serious education, which is one-on-one -on -one private coaching directly with me on Skype calls for about a month and a half, where we're going to run through an intensive coaching from A to Z, taking a person which could be at any level of knowledge and bringing it towards to the professional level. This is what I've been establishing and working on since 2017, guys. So you can check out the video. You can register now as well because you get a free conversation with me on Skype where I could explain you more. Also, look out the entire website. We've been going through 137 students right now. 136, I'm sorry. And things are very, very good. Well, coaching has three important stages, psychology, technical analysis, and live trading. And this is perfect for anyone that has any type of a level and is looking to generate a serious income, a full-time, whether that could be $10,000 or $200,000 per month. And it really depends on your budget that you have to work with. And it's once again only for serious people. You can check out the link in the description or comments there of this video, scramblecoaching.com. I'm waiting you inside. Feel free to like this video, guys. Hit the subscribe button. Click the bell one afterwards. And I'm waiting you in my next videos.